WABC TV, New York. This is Eyewitness News with John Johnson, Anna Bond, and the Eyewitness News team. A United Airlines 747 jet en route to New York from Los Angeles has reportedly been hijacked. United Flight 8 was due to land at JFK near 8 o'clock tonight. It is not yet known whether the plane is still heading towards New York. There were 119 passengers and 12 crew members on board. We'll have details as soon as they become available. More news and Sal Marciano with the sports when we return. And now here's Sal Marciano with the sports. Thank you, Anna. As seen on ABC, Ozzy Ocasio has scored a unanimous 10-round decision over Jimmy Young. The 21-year-old Puerto Rico now gets a chance at the WBC's heavyweight champ, Larry Holmes. Arthur Ashe stunned Vitas Gerolaitis in the semifinals of the U.S. Pro Indoor Tennis Championships. Ashe rallied from a two-set deficit to win 1-6, 4-6, 7-6, 6-4, 6-4. Ashe will meet either Jimmy Connors or Roscoe Tanner in the finals. And now for the man responsible for bringing us such a beautiful day, Storm Field. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Actually, I wasn't really responsible yesterday. I thought it would stay mostly cloudy. We just got lucky. As a matter of fact, if you got up this morning, maybe a slight case of amnesia, looked outside, you probably thought it was March because that's what it felt like. Sunny skies and very mild temperatures. Look at our readings right now. We're up at 43 degrees. I mean, Next on Channel 7, you, Gil Noble, and the Eyewitness News team will be back at 11.15 tonight. I'm Anna Bond. Have a nice what's left of the weekend, John. Nice. Just a reminder that Eyewitness News will be here from now on on Saturdays from 6.30 to 7 with Anna Bond and me, and we hope you will join us. I'm John Johnson. Good news to you. Good night. Eyewitness News is the New York area's number one news presentation and for the second consecutive year, recognized by the Associated Press as New York State's best regularly scheduled newscast. Hi, I'm Ellie Dillon. Obviously, we're in Chinatown and we're going to talk about a lot more than the Chinese New Year next on you.